Hi, this is a Luraco Big Chop Pump or Grain Pump. Um, we received this one uh, return from our uh, dealer and um, they say that it's uh, making noise and uh, we see that you can see on the back you know the water uh, I see a lot of water stain on the back and it get into the bearing and then uh, it make noise so this one is uh, easy you know you can see the right away if you plug into the to the outlet and you see the noise come out from the bearing because the water get into the bearing uh, create um, the noise but you know it's sometime uh, we have a one salon um, that they have to fix the chop pump very often because they use some kind of the powder and the powder get into the impeller and, and, and make impeller stuff not spinning and then they have to uh, take the ditch chop pump out open one, two, three, four, four screw open this four screw and clean it and uh, put it back and then the pump working again but you know it costs them a lot because they have to call the plumbing um, you know a, a plumber come out and fix for them but uh, you as salon or you are the dealer it is easy when the um, client call and say my ditch pump is not running uh, there are a lot of things involving when client say that the ditch pump is not running either the power control box issue or the air button issue or the air tube got loose or something stuck in here or the motor died or the power plug loose something like that is there are several things involved uh, but however it is easy you can see but if you you think that is something in here actually you can open one two three four four screw on here you can see the bearing inside uh, the, 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 the seal okay the bearing and the seal inside of this uh, this is a four screw on the on the motor but four screw on the top housing that so you can see anything stuck in the impeller okay the problem that you know we uh, find out that many salon out there they don't use the control box with the timer for this chop pump we we you know we noticed that it this is a fake this is a fake Luraco power box control and this is a real Luraco power box control and we receive this from our dealer and they sent to us five of these because they say that they replace uh, the uh, the mag uh, magna pump and few months later magna pump motor burn and replace a new set few months later motor burn motor burn motor burn again and again and they say that and they call an electrician and electrician came out and say everything fine and except they say that there's something wrong with this so they say Luraco power box control have problem and they send the five motor along with the five power box back to us but when we look at the power box we know we say this is not Luraco power box Luraco power box is this one okay they copy everything is uh, identical and exactly the same the label is not Luraco label but the problem is like I talked in the other video they combine the jet the LED the jet LED and then the drain pump ditch pump in one switch it means when they turn the jet on ditch pump also turn on underneath of the basin or when they turn on the ditch pump to drain the water out the magnetic jet also turn on that explain why magna jet had running dry and the bearing got burned so for Luraco you can see here this port 
e4 this chop hum and we add three minute timer to it okay this one for water pump and color light this one for this chop pump this port have an electronic and we add three minute timer to it so when you activate this port only this chop pump turn on and three minutes later it automatic shut off okay but out there they say few dollars but you know increase so, but they spend a lot of money for service and repair is more on the top of that is a very headache because the problem the the seal and bearing of the deep chop pump burn out or, or uh, worn out quickly because whenever they turn on the magna jet for service the digital pump also running 10 minutes 50 minutes dry running dry underneath of the basin that is a big problem when they buy cheap lower cost spark control no timer combine everything in one kick on everything's on save few dollars but create a lot of problem before we receive some digital pump we open it and we saw the seal damage but we don't know why we know if they're running with the water how come the seal damage here we test you know a lot and uh, many uh you know supermarkets and uh, and the fish pond and also the water fountain they use rubber pump and they come back and say 10 years we use your water pump for 10 years no problem 24 over 7 no problem but why we say why you in paddock gear spa and not 24 7 but why the bearing is burned you know why right because you cheap power box control no timer okay this explain why that does the the the, the pump make noise either the water get into the bearing or the seal got damaged because running dry so i hope that this video will help so at salon and uh, uh, spa dealer please do not use cheap power box control do not combine this jack pump and the jet with the one box only you must have a separate you must have a one air button to activate the discharge pump with time delay in there. Discharge pump must have a time delay. Thank you.